Dan here. I'm still in the middle of the Boot Sudan build, but I had some materials that I cut off from that build that I decided to use for something else. This is sort of a divertissement. Enjoy. It's just a short little bit. So I had this cut off from another project and decided that I didn't want to waste it. I thought the cutoff would make a nice trivet. So I cut a quarter inch groove into the end grains on both sides after evening up the sides, making their angles proper, and then went to the walnut that I had from the Boot Sedan project, found a piece that I wasn't going to be using, and getting it smoothed down to close to the proper size. Then I used my number 78 rebate plane and cut a quarter inch tongue down the sides of the walnut. I love this rebate plane. Then I glued them up overnight and brought them out to my vise the next day. It was one of those days where the rain had decided to abate a little bit, even give us a little bit of a sun. Then came the fiddly work of flushing up the handles to the trivet body. When I started sanding, I discovered I needed a better way to hold the trivet to the bench and that the bars on my quick-release bar clamps fit into my bench dog holes. So I filed off the stop at the end of the bar, removed the movable jaw, slid the bar clamp into the bench dog hole, and moved the movable jaw back up the bar, and suddenly I have a hold down. Then I decided to create a relief on the underside, the bottom side of the trivet, for fingers to reach under. So I dug a crude channel with my chisels, and plane down the edges to a curve. I won't call it an OG and I won't call it a roundover. Kind of elliptical curve. And after a final sanding and a coat of finish, here is the trivet. The walnut really stood out. There was no stain in the finish, but it really stood out against the oak. If you like this video, please check out my other videos. And of course, like, comment, and subscribe to this video. It really helps the channel. Thank you for watching.